to be the sun in someone's life to brighten their day. But why not be the moon to shine in their darkest hour? Wow, what a thought. Everyone needs a light to shine in the darkest hour. Are you willing to be the light for someone in need? Hi, my name is Rachel. I would like to tell you about my career as a registered nurse, about my family, and about why I think people are apprehensive to public speaking. I have known that I wanted to be a nurse from a very young age. Taking care of people is something near and dear to my heart and has always been my passion. Whether I'm celebrating with a patient who's taken their first steps after a serious stroke for the first time in months, or sitting by the bedside of a dying patient consoling their family as they take their last breaths, I have no doubt that I'm right where God intended for me to be. Next, I would like to tell you about my family. My husband and I have been married for 15 years. We were married the month after Hurricane Katrina hit. It has been quite the ride. We started this marriage off with a bang, to say the least. We have two children, an eight-year-old boy and a three-year-old little girl. They are spoiled rotten and they're absolutely everything we could have asked for. There's never a dull moment in our house. And when you throw our one-year-old miniature schnauzer in the mix, it's really fun. Welcome to our beautiful mess. And finally, I would like to tell you why I think people are apprehensive to public speaking. I think the biggest reason is a lack of self-confidence. People get nervous when they speak in front of a group, a small group or a large group. I feel like if we can provide our peers with constructive criticism, that that would help them. Try to show them ways that they can improve and boost their confidence until we see improvements. So in conclusion, I have told you about my career that I love, my family, and why I think people are apprehensive to public speaking. I hope that you can find pure happiness in your career just as I have, and don't forget to be the light that someone else needs. I hope you have a great day.